Hey everybody. I hope y'all can hear me. All right, so we're going along and setting our intentions, guys, for this new moon energy. And this is just like a little tune that's been playing in my head. Go ahead and set your intentions. Cause the new moon energy is here. Go on, set your intentions. The new moon energy is here. Burn your candles, light your sage, and bring in some new days. Go on. Set your intentions. That new moon energy is here. So let freestyle. Yes, boo boo. Get y'all crystals, okay? Cleanse, cleanse, cleanse. Cleanse your space, guys. Cleanse your, your areas. Cleanse your rooms. Just go ahead and set your intentions okay set your intentions i love new moon energy i love the new moon energy love 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 it all right i got my manifest that sh candle going right here yes this candle is on the website guys you can order this candle here manifest that sh candle Check that out on the website. The website is EmpressEmpireOils.com. EmpressEmpireOils.com. Yes. Also, guys, we have the Sage Bundles there as well. There is going to be a lot of new items coming to the website tomorrow. So, guys, stay tuned. I got some new items coming tomorrow. All right. So, guys, let's talk. Oh, yeah, the, um, the money bag oil, guys, it's on sale today. It is on sale, $15.55, okay, to get the money back. Oil. Yes, 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 hunties. Yes, yes. I'm waiting for labels to come in, so your items will be labeled. All right? So let's talk, guys. We got some new moon energy coming in. New moon in Scorpio. Scorpio. Sounds mysterious. <laughs> All right, so... I want to keep this sage going. Let's get it. Let's see what messages we get, okay? I am using the Moonology Oracle cards, okay? So let's see what messages we get from Spirit, okay? With this new moon energy. Thank you. If you're new to my channel, welcome, guys. I forgot to say that earlier. <laughs> if you are new, welcome, guys. Go ahead and click the bell to subscribe, okay? We would love to have you here, okay? So let's talk, guys. New moon messages. What messages do you have? What's coming towards us in this new moon energy? What can we expect? What's coming? What can we expect? What can we expect? Oh no, this is a lot of cards that jumped out. Well, this is actually three cards. I was looking for three cards. Okay. So at the bottom, we have nothing is yet set in stone. Okay, so Spirit is saying, you know, look, this is the time, okay, to be bold and make the first move, okay? Nothing's yet written in stone, okay? So now it is time. I feel like it's time to take action, okay? It's time to take action. All right, so the first card we have is step outside of your comfort zone. It's time to step outside of your comfort zone. This is North Node, okay? Step outside of your comfort zone. What are you passionate about? Okay, what are you what are what are you good at? What do you like to do? What would you do even if you weren't getting paid to do it? 
You would just do it just because. Okay? Stepping outside of your day-to-day -day routine. It's time to step outside of your comfort zone. Do something that you wouldn't normally do. Okay? Take things to the next level. Taking it to the next level. Okay? Six of Swords. Ooh, if you're trying to move on from this poverty mindset, from not having um, everything that you desire, okay, still holding on to the past, you know, it's time to let, it's time to let things go, okay? It's time for, for new energy, fresh new energy, okay? Have the confidence, okay? Have the confidence to make this happen, okay? You got to start making plans and preparing, preparing for your future, Write things down, script, make a vision board. Those type of things will help you manifest, you know, manifest in your future, okay? Oh, yeah. It's definitely time to wrap up some chapters here, okay? But not, not only do we have the Six of Swords, not only do we have the Six of Swords, but we got the world. So a lot of people are wrapping up chapters, okay? All right, see, look, it's time to plan and prep for our blessings, for our abundance, okay? Seven of Pentacles, you, you're you planning, okay? Some of y'all are investing. I'm getting a lot of y'all are investing, okay? It's time to invest. Invest your money. If you aren't investing, it's time that you look into investing, into your passion, okay? Step outside of your comfort zone. It's time to do something new, okay? And you can't get discouraged if you don't immediately start making money uh, right off the bat because I got the Four of Cups as well as the, the Ten of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles. So you can't be disappointed if you aren't, you know, like step your foot out there one time. You don't get the likes that you want, so you give up. No, this you have to continue, you know, work on it. Invest. Keep it going. Okay? Yep, see, look. Don't stop. Don't worry about how it, in the beginning it's a process, okay? It's a, definitely a process. Don't worry about who's watching Who's going to, you know, I don't have any support. I don't have any followers. I don't have, you. that's not the way to look at it. If you go into it looking at it that way, then that's going to be your outcome, okay? So we're closing chapters here. We're closing chapters and we are on some new, new. We on some new, new, okay? Some new, new stuff. All right, so the next card we have here is your dreams need a practical plan, your dreams need a practical plan, okay? So like I said, it's time to plan, plot, strategize. Go ahead and start making the investments, okay? Plan it first, okay? Plan it first. Sit down and come up with a plan. Visualize it. See it. Feel it. Write it down. Yeah, see, I don't want you to feel as if you're not sure if it's going to be worth it or some of y'all, you have to do the research, okay? Do the research, get online, look at other people, be inspired by other people. You have to go ahead and get a practical approach, okay? A practical plan on first what is it that you like to do? Second, how can you market that and box that up and present that to a group of people who would potentially buy your products, okay? Buy a book, buy your uh, seminars, okay? A lot of you are sitting on skills and talents that the world needs, okay? <laughs> and only you can do it your way people need to see it in different aspects it doesn't matter if one person is already doing it we need to see it your way okay it's a bag out here for everybody okay a win-win outcome is in the forecast okay it's like no way come on y'all you you got this okay this is seven of cups this is several streams possibly of income this is somebody who has a multitude of ideas okay take your time take your time 
it's going to grow okay take your time it's going to grow whatever ideas it is that you have and whatever it is that you're trying to manifest don't try to move too fast take your time it will grow okay you'll start seeing your followers going up you'll start seeing your support system uh going up and what a lot of people don't understand is in a lot of things i have to understand this excuse me guys as well that the people that you think will support you may not support you okay but that's fine that's okay that's okay because you're going to grasp onto a group of, of followers that really adore you really admire you um who you know the your family and friends your so-called friends they'll jump on board afterwards but by then you you know it's like okay well you should have been here while I was putting this together. You should have lended a helping hand. You could have clicked share. You could have clicked like. You know, your biggest thing is that's a that's a big hurdle, okay? If you can get past, you know, not having the support right off the bat and growing a following, you know, um, growing your growing your product, okay? Marketing, all that stuff. It's fun, you know? Take it as a journey. You're not going to... I'm telling you, you have to go ahead and put your first foot forward, okay? Right now is a good time to invest in something that you like to do, what you're passionate about, okay? Right now is this time, okay? It's time to manifest. Manifest. Manifest that shit. You can do it, okay? Before I jump into the tarot, let's do the uh, the Oracle of E. <laughs> I'm just now really starting to work with this deck here. I've had it for a while, but, you know, I'm going to give it a chance. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of y'all are afraid to, to step outside of the box and do something that you're really passionate about because you're you're afraid of what others may think or such and such. They over there doing it. I don't want them to think that. Child, please. They can't do it like you. And that's just not a good way to think. You know? That's like me getting on here being afraid to be to do tarot because everybody else doing tarot. Like that's that's not logical. Okay. So let's see. Okay. Y'all comment below. Let me know what are some of the ideas that some of you have. Like, even if you guys have good ideas, I think I'm going to set up a P.O. box to where you guys can um, send me items and we just help each other. Like, I have, you know, about 12,000 subscribers here as of right now, you know, and definitely, like, we can help each other grow, okay? I may, I may consider doing that in the near future. Like, you guys can send me products and, you know, we review the products and stuff to that nature. Like, I'm willing to do those type of things because I, I feel like this community is a very healthy community. I'm pretty sure I have a lot of entrepreneurs here, okay, or ones that want to be entrepreneurs and don't know where to start. Or have a really nice product, but may not be getting any sales or, you know, have, you know, marketing. Okay. We got to support each other. We have to support each other. Okay. What message do you have for new moon energy? Bring it. <laughs> bring it <laughs> I'm telling y'all it is now time to put forth action okay it's now time it's time to launch that website it's time to launch that new product it's time to launch it's time 
Okay, we got entangled. Hmm, interesting. The dude abides. Brand spanking new. Didn't I tell you? It's time to launch that new idea. It's time to launch that website. It's time to launch that new product. It's time, okay? It's time to do something new. It's time to uh, open up your store. It's time to buy some new um, curtains to go in your room. It's time to buy some new linen to put on your bed. It's time to buy, you know, something that, something new, something fresh, something new, okay? It's going to help you feel good, help you get to the next level, okay? Open your presents. <laughs> I do want to see what uh, the tarot has to say about bring it. <laughs> Six of Wands. That is success, okay? I'm telling you, whatever it is that you got, it's, it, it may hit, okay? But you will never know if you don't put that out, you know, put that energy out there, you know, put it out there, okay? Entangled. King of Wands. Ooh, Emperor. Ooh, okay. The King of Wands, he's known to take action. The Emperor is boss energy, okay? I'm getting a lot of, like, boss energy, okay? I'm, I'm just getting it. See, look at this. Three of Pentacles here at the bottom of the deck. I'm getting, like, a lot of boss energy, I'm, I'm definitely, yes, yes, see, <laughs> see, I'm getting as well, like showing off your, something that you've been working on, okay, the fool, the page of swords is people watching and looking, seven of pentacles, people been waiting to see this, this is something that you've been being patient, you know, patiently been working on, it's like for some of you, it's a website, it's a website, it's a, it's a physical location, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm definitely hearing it. The dude abides. Where is, oh, here it is. Let's see what the cards have to say about the dude abides. It's my first time seeing that one. I know, so I'm just got a feeling like a lot of y'all got some new, fresh ideas that you are just ready or you've been thinking about it. Like, you know. Is it time? Mm. Okay. I'm falling. <laughs> Did I skip it? I think I skipped it. All right. Um, where is it? Where is it? But like I was saying, I feel like some of y'all have these bomb ass ideas that you're sitting on or you just don't feel have the confidence to put it out there but no now's the time do it launch that idea launch it launch it launch it launch it i'm telling y'all this is weird but i don't even see this one here <laughs> i don't even see this one here 20 okay I uh, skipped it. There we go. It is your lucky day. In your lucky life, the dude is patiently waiting for you to come on home. Let him do the heavy lifting for a change. No matter what crazy mess you've gotten yourself into, the dude is here with everything you could ever need. The dude's got your back. Rock star. Mm. <laughs> and you know what's so crazy about this is some of you are manifesting uh, a commitment here. 
I got the Hierophant, the Justice, and the King of Pentacles. Some of you are manifesting a very stable person here, male or female. Some of y'all may be feeling like you're uncertain. For some of you, it's somebody from the past who's returning. Um, and for some of you, it's new. Um, but I'm getting that all of this, this energy here, this five of swords energy, when it comes to love, yeah, you're leaving that in the past. That's over with. That's done. That is over with. Okay, you're going to have somebody who is for real, for real. So not only are you manifesting, uh, for a lot of you manifesting business and um, opportunities and, you know, new beginnings. Some of you are manifesting the love of your life. <laughs> Some of you are manifesting the love of your life, baby. Not that we're talking about some love, love. Let's see what we get. Let me pull a few from the Romance Angels. Where is my Romance Angel deck? Oh, I see it. It's all the way over there. So now let's talk about love. It looks like, okay, some of y'all are going to be manifesting uh, manifesting career and your finances and money, and abundance, prosperity. That's going to be a gain. Okay, so let's talk about love. Let's talk about love, boo-boom. Let's get into it. Y'all make sure y'all hitting the like button for me. And comment in below. Y'all let me know what's going on. Who is starting a business? Who has a new item that they are getting ready to launch on their website? Or just a new, you know, something that they have come up with. And, you know, it's in the beginning stages. Okay. Y'all comment below. Let me know what's going on. There may be someone here in the chat that needs your service, okay? All right. All right, let's see. What messages do we have in love? messages are there in love new moon energy please what can we expect in love what messages for people who are in love i'm gonna do a message for singles as well but this one right here is for people who are in love okay Finances and career. A lot of you guys' is energy is really solely on your career. Okay, some of y'all are really, really zoomed in and tied into your financing your career. Or this could be a situation, a love romance that you met at work or you're dealing with at work, you know, something to that nature. Okay. I feel like there's something that you could be paying attention to. There's something that you notice about this person. I feel like um, you may have felt like this person could be the one because you you may notice known this person for a while or this is someone from the past who returned during a retrograde. Mm -hmm. But you are noticing something here. You're you're you notice something. There's some signs that are cautioning you. Um, I, I see that as well. Like maybe you feel like this person is very very codependent or they have some type of codependent issues like they could you know drink a lot they depend on you know the, the codependency card is kind of like the devil card okay that's you know when you're codependent uh there's kind of like a it's kind of like a 
possessive or um, for some is it could be drugs okay drugs alcohol someone could be addicted to you know just addictions you know okay with the first card we got is codependency yeah they're controlling okay some of y'all could be dealing with an aries but i'm getting like some of y'all are tired of this person they're too controlling okay they're too controlling they're too controlling yeah yeah the two of cups here some of you want to separate king of swords i'm telling you like the way this person talks is too aggressive this person comes off too aggressive okay um when they communicate okay i don't feel like you like that um of course who would but i feel like you feel like the situation is unrequited at this point like you know is there enough it's a turn off is basically what i'm saying you may feel like this that's a turn off okay they, they, the way they speak, the way they communicate, okay? Then we got unrequited love. See, look at this. These two cards, they're, they're turned away from each other. That's the first thing that I noticed here. They're both knights. So the energy is very, like, childlike. Um, and they're both facing away from each other. Like, I don't, I, I just feel like some of y'all are, are at odds with a partner right now. And it's because you just aren't seeing eye to eye. Like, you just... It's unrequited. It's not enough chemistry right now. Yeah, see. Both of you guys, yeah. See, the five of swords and the nine of wands. Both of y'all are just kind of like in a very argumentative state. Okay. Yeah, there's some issues that needs to be balanced out. For sure. Then we got deception here. So you could just be feeling like this person is a liar. They lied about something. They weren't completely honest. You know, they they messed up the trust in the relationship. Some of you are wanting to move forward so bad, but I feel like there's something here about this person that keeps you that keeps you stuck here. Okay? There's something here. It's for some it's some type of commitment, possibly like a marriage. But you, I feel like you know that it's best for you to move on. You'll be happier if you were to move on with the Six of Swords, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Ten of Cups, okay? Like, for some of you, it's finances that keep you tied to this person. Um, but I don't feel like you're really, for a lot of you, I don't feel like you're really happy. Um, it's just the state that you're in currently. Like, this person is just too much. They're overbearing. They're controlling could be dealing with an Aquarius. The star card just came out. Um, for some of you, there's no sex, okay? Or the sex isn't good. Um, you, you really want this person to be more compassionate and more caring, okay? You want this person to be more caring, Care more. Show me that you care more. And some of y'all are worried about where this is going to, where this is headed, okay? Yeah. So for some of you that are uh, booed up right now, things could just be kind of like on the rocks right now. Like, you know... This could be with the boot thing. This could be what's going on at home in a marriage. Whatever the case may be. But let's talk. Let's, let me talk to my singles, okay? What message is there for my singles? Y'all hit the thumbs up button. Hit the thumbs up button. Show me some love. What's the new moon bringing in for my singles. Still no more bringing it for my singles. Oh, okay. 
page of pentacles eight of wands okay the high priestess the six of swords the devil and the knight of wands okay Okay, mm. some of y'all are getting ready to find out the truth about someone being a player. But I feel like this is something that you already knew, okay? I feel like there's something that you already intuitively knew, okay? I got the high priestess right here. I feel like you already knew because I got the ace of swords here, which is gaining clarity and gaining the truth. And then the Ten of Pentacles here, this is someone who's already in a relationship or married, okay? This is everybody. The world in the Knight of Cups is like, people, to a lot of, many people probably, you know, it's, it's the talk, the, the word around town, okay? That there is a third party or you're a part of this third party situation, okay? Queen of Wands, Three of Swords. Now, the Six of Wands and the Strength card is here. You could be dealing with the Leo. Um, and the Six of Wands is, you know, a lot of people like somebody who is very popular. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, see, the tower. You're getting ready to get some shocking news. Either If, if you already got it, some of you have already got this little bug in your ear. <laughs> this little birdie in your ear Whatever the saying is However they say it <laughs> But some of y'all are getting ready to get these news Yep Three of cups Okay That somebody here is a part of a third party situation And it's a lot of jealousy And pettiness going on too And somebody's doing something To make somebody mad as well Okay So this could be like over the internet this could be like just some petty, just some petty mess going on. And somebody's about to get cut off. King of Swords. Two of Cups. Somebody's about to get cut off. For sure, for sure. Either you're about to cut somebody off or somebody is about to cut you off. Okay? See, the Four of Wands. Somebody is saying that they already, they told somebody that they were already married or living with someone or already in a relationship. Okay? But they be, they, this someone here likes act single, but they really married. Okay, they really married or in a commitment already, and they just being reckless, doing what they do, running around, okay, creating little love scenarios, and now it's time to make a decision, okay, some of y'all are moving on, y'all moving on, y'all letting this be, six of swords, I'm telling you, some of y'all moving on. You find out the truth. You find out that this person was a liar and had you in a third-party situation, okay? You was possibly like, this is things when things are hidden, okay? It was kept a secret, okay? You possibly, like, just want to know really how this person feel. You could be dealing with a Libra as well. But this person is a liar. Somebody, somebody here is a liar, and it is what it is. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. I got the devil here. And the uh, strength card, which is Leo's energy. Some of y'all started, like... Some of y'all... Okay, this is past energy. Like, some of y'all just wanted to take this risk. Okay, you, you possibly, like, knew it was risky. But you just wanted to take the risk anyway. So you took the risk and you was just kind of like waiting it out to see who was going to be the last person standing. You know, who is going, whatever it is, what it is. It is what it is. Okay. But going ahead for future energy, we got the Knight of Wands. We noticed the player card. Okay. We noticed the player card. Four of Cups. And this you being disappointed because you feel like, you know, you got played. Now we got the Empress here. Chariot. Seven of Pentacles, three of Wands. 
see. I feel like some of y'all are waiting to see, like, how this is going to go. King Cups, Pisces, Cats, Scorpio. But this is to see, like, how somebody feels, like, their true feelings, their emotions. You're waiting to see if their emotions or how they feel is going to change. And then we got the Queen of Cups and the Knight of Cups. Some of y'all are, like, pleading to this person, telling this person how y'all feel and all that. That's not even necessary. That's not even necessary. If this person to play, you got to take a person for who they is and what they is and what they not showed you. All right? So I hope this message was helpful, y'all. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. If you want to book a personal reading with me, guys, I'm doing personal readings today. $20. I'm sorry, $22.22, guys. Um, you can contact me via email. And you could do love, general, or money and career. Okay. All that information is in the drop box below. You can go check out the website um, to go order your candles and your sage, your Palo Santo sticks. There is going to be some new items on the website tomorrow. Tomorrow is the day, guys. We're doing new, we're setting new intentions, doing new things. Okay. So, yes, I'm going to talk to y'all later. I love you guys. Ciao.